Hey guys, it's Jeremiah with Ride On Optics. Today we're talking about the rut reticle. We find this reticle in the second focal plane with MOA adjustment. So, what is MOA, or minute of angle? Well, MOA is a linear measurement, and what it equates to is one MOA at 100 yards equals one inch. One MOA at 200 yards equals two inches. So if we took that out to 1,000 yards, one MOA would be 10 inches. The reason this is important is many of the right on optics have quarter minute of angle adjustments. Those adjustments will be one quarter of an inch at 100 yards, one half an inch at 200 yards, and if we took that out to 1,000 yards again, one click or one quarter minute adjustment would equal 2.5 inches at 1,000 yards. Now let's talk second focal plane. What second focal plane means is our reticle inside of our optic is not going to change or appear to change throughout the magnification range. This is going to be important to know because if you have a 20 power scope with say two minute of angle hash marks in it, that's going to only be two minute of angle on that 20 power, on that maximum power. So you'll need to know that at 10 power, those same two minute of angle hash marks are now four minute of angle hash marks. This is because our target grows and shrinks, but our reticle does not. So we need to take this into account when picking a scope and also when using a scope so that we know our accurate subtensions. Now let's talk about this reticle. The rut reticle can be used in many scenarios, but designed specifically for hunting. One of the things we've done with this reticle is take a, taken a traditional duplex reticle and opened up the upper hemisphere so that there's a wider field of view here so that you can see your animals. It has a half minute of angle center dot, which is a nice precise dot with one minute of angle gaps either side and underneath. Again, the idea being field of view. Along with that, there are one minute of angle hash marks for windage and for elevations for precision. But we've taken every second minute of angle and given it a larger line. That way it's easy to count by twos or by ones. All right, guys, that's it. Thanks for taking the time to learn with us today. If you have any other questions, we're eager to hear them. Reach out to us at Right On Optics.